Hello, my name is Samuel Fordham. Uh, I'm an artist and educator and the course leader on documentary photography and print for Boom Satsuma. If I had to talk about a philosophy for the course, I would say we are trying to make photographers who are as at home making photographs as they are working within print-based contexts and doing that through the continual making of work. Photographers are increasingly needing to design and create books themselves, as well as being able to create prints, uh, not only for themselves, but for other artists too. An education in photography is important because you get to learn about yourself, who you are. You also get to engage with the world and understand humanity. We will equip our students with the skills, techniques and professional attitudes required to work across the entire spectrum of photographic and publishing practices, be it in a gallery, in an archive or an agency. Life on the course is going to be practical above everything else. We're going to be continually making work. You're going to make work individually, but also collaboratively with your collective. You're going to be supporting each other, listening to each other, making each other think. We are very lucky on the Documentary Photography and Print course to be partnering with the Royal Photographic Society. Our students are going to be learning in context at RPS House, which is situated in the heart of Bristol's photographic scene. Our students are also going to be able to engage and assist with the RPS themselves and build a portfolio of actual professional practice. It's very important for our students to build their networks internationally in Europe and further afield just as much as it is to build their networks in the UK. That's why we take our students to international photography festivals in Europe but we're also going to make the most of the varied international festivals within the UK itself. Throughout the three years you'll be engaging in projects that range from editorial and commercial photography to long-form photographic art-based photography as well as engaging with skills in cinematography, design, bookmaking and VR sequences. One of the most exciting things about this course is that we've written into the curriculum what we call block weeks. The block weeks are a really important uh, aspect of the course. They help students to engage with more experimental approaches to techniques and technologies that they perhaps haven't experimented with before. It's also intensely collaborative, so they'll be making work with their peers and with students from outside of their courses as well. Um, and it's also an opportunity for the students to start building their professional network. So we'll be bringing in artists and practitioners from the professional field into Bristol at Boom Satsuma. And it's those relationships that our students are going to be able to take with them into the first few years of their career. My name is Jamie L. Murray and I'll be joining Sam for the Documentary Photography and Print course here at Boom Satsuma. The type of work that I make uh, very much revolves around uh, contemporary storytelling within uh, the photographic field, something that I think is integral uh, to the documentary side of the medium. What I hope to bring to the course is a link between education and the industry. And the industry operates in a few different planes. So for me, that would be um, the professional side, uh, the kind of areas where you might be commissioned, where you can often make a living from, but also the artistic and more personal-led side, where hopefully you can engage with and interrogate your own issues with the world. In the past few years, we've really seen Bristol gain momentum in the photographic field. With Martin Power Foundation, the Royal Photographic Society moving here, and also with the Bristol Photo Festival being set up, it's a really exciting place to be for photography. A contemporary photographer has to work across a number of fields. To do that, you really have to learn your interests as an individual and your skill set. This course is going to be a perfect moment for you to figure out what it is you're interested in and to apply that to your photography within documentary photography and print. We are having a limited number of spaces to 20 students. What this really allows us to do is to be mobile, to work together as a team, and when we encounter something within contemporary culture, within uh, current events, we can respond to it quickly, creating exhibitions, books, uh, getting your work out there into the world. Within the past decade or so, we've also seen a resurgence in printmaking. This really is looking at the analogue processes from start to finish. A key part of being a contemporary photographer is being able to understand these analogue processes and allow them to feed into your work working with digital equipment as well. We're going to operate on the boundary between the two where we can teach you both aspects, both fields and you can then engage with both of them moving forward into the industry. Both me and Sam are incredibly excited to start this course. I feel like there is as much I can learn from you as you can learn from me and as a group together 
the, the mobile aspect of the course, that ability to work as a team, is something that will really help us engage with each other and, in a broader sense, the world around us.